All right, guys, here's the situation. We just, we're currently in 22nd place. This is day two of the Crappie Masters Elite Series, Truman Lake. I had filmed everything yesterday, and unfortunately, I lost it all. So you're gonna go right to the championship Saturday, and that's where we're at right now. You can see everybody starting to load up right now. They're calling out boat numbers. We're actually boat 12, so we're running at the, pretty much the end. Check it out. Two things are rolling here, boat number 41. Ethan. So that's the situation. We just kind of sit here and wait till our number's called, and then we go up there. So um, we're gonna take you along for the ride. Here we go. And Darren Young. Pulling in behind Brian and Darren. It's gonna be boat 10, Mike Valentine. All right, guys, I was gonna take a short break. Uh, currently, we're sitting around eight pounds. Um, one really good fish, actually the best fish we've had all week. Uh, so we're, we're better off than we were on day one, but um, we're not finding the big fish right now. So we're only in the midday, we're okay. Uh, I wanted to guys point out hog fishing. I don't talk about them enough, but hog fishing right there, totally customizable. Uh, nets, 225 variations. You've got your six to 12 foot extension pole. There's also a six foot pole. People are loving the ruby red, so check that out. You can match your boats however you want to do it. You can actually change the nets too that are part of the hoop. So everything is customizable. Again, thanks to all our sponsors, PTG, <coughs> the original fish formula, um, cornfield fishing gear, <coughs> excuse me, hog fishing, snipe and braid, all those great companies. Um, we're gonna dump, but it's hot. <coughs> Should be. Hold on. Pound. We'll take it though. Let's weigh it. And see if it gets to a pound. Let's see what that guy weighs. Still a pound, you think? This is, could be a good one. This could be a good one. Oh. Oh. I cannot believe it, dude. That thing was marking massive. Pretty big, dude. All right, you finally measure this fucker. I'd be pissed. Yeah. I see. Nope. Oh, 
see if it gets real angry. All right, guys, we just got done with the weigh-in, or I'm sorry, we just got, all right, guys, we just got done with the uh, the fishing. Now we're gonna go to the weigh-in, okay? Here's sickness after a day of hard work on the water. Uh, she's kind of beaten up, I ain't gonna lie. But if you guys notice, I took the Kapawa uh, props off the uh, crappie bricks, had some struggles with those. Um, struggles were perhaps creating too much torque for, for the boat, but it's doing a lot of heck on my power pole. So I ended up taking them off. I thought that was one of the factors on the knuckle as well. So I just went back with your standard edge prop. So just a little tidbit there. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go weigh in. We think our number is gonna be pretty close to what it was yesterday. Uh, now the scales could be different. You know, they, they have to calibrate them every day. So yesterday we rang up 10.02. We expect it to be less than that, even though our total weight is uh, about equal. We're about 0 0.10 within yesterday's weight on our own scale. So um, for whatever reason, when they calibrate these scales, it can be calibrated heavy one day, light the next day, you know, those type of things. But this is me just walking to the to the way in and we will be the first team up there. So we try to get up there pretty early because if you don't, you're gonna have to wait for everybody's thank yous and everything. And we've got a long way to go to get home so we're about five and a half hours away from southern illinois see if uh we'll see if my buddy danny's up here somewhere we can chat all right man i have to apparently do this again Thank you. 